Hi everyone, my name is Lena. Let's dive into Psalm 30 for this week's devotional for our Summer in the Psalms. Um, Psalm 30 was written by David uh, during a time of celebration where he is giving God all of the glory and honor um, for all the things that God has done in David's life. And we read through it and we see all the times that God showed up for him and saved him in all of these different ways. But the couple of verses that stood out to me were from verse eight on. I'm going to just read through a couple of those. To you, Lord, I called. To the Lord, I cried for mercy. What is gained if I am silenced, if I go down to the pit? Will the dust praise you? Will it proclaim your faithfulness? Hear, Lord, and be merciful to me. Lord, be my help. That's David just praying um, in his intimate moments with God, in his prayer with God. He has this back and forth with God where he's almost kind of like, arguing for himself and saying, God, save me, because if you save me, I will praise you and I will proclaim your faithfulness. So we see um, how all the different situations that David was saved, um, that God showed up for him multiple times and saved his life. And I'm I know that all of us have had those situations, moments where we've struggled, moments where we thought we could, we were going to give up, and we can have these intimate conversations with God where we're honest and open, and we can almost, uh, I don't know if we can have those moments where we argue for ourselves and, you know, let God know, hey, save me from this situation, and I will be sure to proclaim your faithfulness for the rest of my days. And that psalm closes out with verses 11 and 12 saying, you have turned my morning into dancing. You removed my sackcloth and clothed me with joy that my heart may sing your praises and not be silent. Lord, my God, I will praise you forever. And I hope that we can, even after all of the things that we go through, even in the middle of going through all of those things, that we can continue to praise God for all the good that he has done. God bless.